everyone, and welcome to Ohio Valley Couponer. So today I'm here with a massive, now it's not massive in size, but it is a massive money maker couponing haul today. I made a dollar oh two to take all of this stuff out from Walmart, which is so, so amazing. I just did Walmart. You guys know I usually like to do Walmart and Kroger, but I just did Walmart today because... To be honest, I kind of exhausted all the rebates at Kroger that I could do, like my Kroger cashback. I did all those offers, you know. The beauty event kind of died down for me because most of the good coupons expired yesterday. And so it kind of just, I did not see much at Kroger. And the other reason I just did Walmart is because I got a midweek moneymaker bonus, but it was just for a dollar on five, which sucks. Um, I know a bunch of people got a five dollar on 15. I would have totally loved that. I was close to 15. I think I did 10 or 11 rebates today. So I totally would have loved that. And in that case, I probably would have went to Kroger. But simply just because I only needed five rebates, I was just able to knock it all out at Walmart, which is kind of nice because it took up less of my day to do it this way. Um, but, you know, hopefully I'm hoping Kroger picks back up um, on Wednesday with the new mega event. And I'm hoping I get some really good deals with that. But of course, if you haven't exhausted all your rebates at Kroger, you could do a really nice haul over there. There's some really awesome deals right now. So if you haven't seen my Kroger videos, go and watch those. All right, so let's get some things out of the way here in the beginning. Um, printable breakdown in the description. You guys can print it out, take it with you in the store, or view it on your smartphone. It's got basically a typed up version of all of these deals. Um, so definitely do that. Now, I'd encourage you, watch the video too. Um, I don't know if any of you guys just skip straight to the printable breakdown or not, but that I think so, because a lot of times I get questions basically about things I talked about in the video. Um, so I definitely would encourage you guys to watch the video too, because I go more in detail here. The printable breakdown is kind of just the bare bones, not really too much to it. It's kind of the cut and dry version, not all the extra notations and experiences and stuff like that. So definitely, but printable breakdown is a great resource to have. Also in the description box below, new printable coupons. We got some epic new printable coupons on Sunday. Those are available in the description box below to print. It really, really helps me out when you guys print. It allows me to keep on bringing you guys these videos. So if you do enjoy my videos and you want them to continue, please consider grabbing that. And finally, rebate app referral codes. Those are also in the description box. So if you've not hopped on Ibotta, um, Fetch Rewards, Shopkick especially. Shopkick is so great. I'm so glad Shopkick kind of like came back with the deals. Flues, all those apps, my referral codes for those in the description box. It'd be greatly, greatly appreciated if you guys would sign up using my referral codes for that. So yeah, that is all I got. Let's just dive on into the deals and we don't have to start with anything because we're just got Walmart today. So Walmart. I would definitely encourage you guys to go watch the Walmart video that I did. Um, it went up on Monday. So yesterday when you guys are seeing this, um, go check that out. There's a lot of other deals that personally I didn't do that you could do. So definitely um, consider checking that out. I like to do both the in-store videos where I show you guys all the deals and then I show you all my personal hauls because sometimes I do things a little different or I don't grab a certain thing because, you know, we got to make these bonuses kind of work out for us. But the first thing I did, and I can't even believe this came back, was the Malto Meal Cereal Bundle on Shopkick. Can't even believe it, but it reset. I, I don't even understand why they keep giving us this. Um, I get a bunch, a bunch of comments about this when people saying like, it's not scanning for me in the store. Okay. It's not. And here's, here's the deal. Shopkick has told me they are trying to, um, they're trying to get this fixed, but for right now, it's still denying it. Their system's not picking it up. So it's not going to scan for you. The scan kicks aren't going to work. What you got to do, submit your receipt, buy it, and then it'll deny it. You'll simply email Shopkick at help at shopkick.com. Tell them, hey, I bought two multi meal cereals. There's no size specification, no nothing. They were, uh, you know, they should have qualified for the rebate. Can you give me however many kicks? In this case, it's 2,100. And every single time they have gone in and given me the kicks. Now, they always seem to give me these select variety kicks, but not the any multi meal kicks. Make zero sense at all. But anyway, anyway. What I did today was I grabbed one of these churro cereals at a dollar. I grabbed one of the Frosted Flakes at a dollar. And I scanned the bigger bags of Frosted Flakes. And they said the Frosted Flakes were included under the um, select varieties. So that was good to go. And then this was just for the any multi-meal cereal. So these are a dollar each at Walmart. 
I had a shop kick for 2100 kicks, which is the equivalent of $8.40 back. So I paid $2 and I will get back $8.40 likely after me contacting them and telling them I should have got these kicks, but they've done it for me. I've done it at least five or six times and they've always given me the kicks because it should work and they acknowledge that, but their system is just, I don't know, their system just doesn't recognize it. So anyways, it's going to be free plus a $6.40 moneymaker and that's what made all this other stuff happen today, which was great. Okay. The Annie's Mac and Cheese is an amazing deal. And I mentioned this in my video yesterday, but Donna commented telling me that there was a, I bought a bonus for this, which made it even better. So I bought three of the Annie's Mac and Cheese. They're just a dollar over at Walmart. I used a 50 cents off of two Annie's, any Annie's product printable coupon that is in the description. So utilize that. I bought a head rebate for 20 cents back on these. So I got that back times three. So that was 60 cents back. And I bought a head of bonus. If I did this offer three times I would get a dollar back and I did it three times so I got an extra one dollar bonus it makes this 90 cents for all three or 30 cents each which is wonderful I can totally totally take that so 30 cents for some mac and cheese there and I think Annie's by far is the best mac and cheese it's so much better than Kraft in my opinion so great time to stock up the can do flushable wipes here are $1.88. I had a 75 cent. I bought it, making it $1.13. I did this Colgate Renewal toothpaste today. This is an amazing, amazing money making deal. This is $6.96 at Walmart. Imagine paying that, but $6.96. I had a printable from the Colgate website for 75 cents off, and that printable will be in the description. So utilize that. I got back a whopping $5 on Ibotta. There was a $5 rebate on Ibotta for this. Five bucks back. So that's craziness. And then Shopkick has a rebate for $2.06 back. Makes this free plus an 85 cent moneymaker. Cannot beat that. That is amazing, amazing, amazing. All right. I grabbed the Gerber Teether Wheels. These are $1.96 and there is $1.50 Ibotta for any Gerber Teether product. Making these 46 cents. I am so hoping... Maybe this is just wishful thinking. I'm hoping Kroger puts the Gerber snacks. A lot of times they'll run them on Mega for 99 cents. And I'm hoping they do because that way we can do the $1.50 rebate there and make money. So I'm hoping they do that. But that's something we'll have to check on Wednesday when I look around the store for the deals. Okay. Gillette trial size deodorant. I actually grabbed this on Sunday because this is the last one in my store. Which is why I never, I always have to venture out to another Walmart because my store never tends to have everything. But thankfully they did have everything else today. So... Anyways, the Gillette Cool Wave deodorant was $1.96. I had a $1, no, I'm sorry, $1.97. It was $1.97. I had a $1. I bought a rebate. And then Shopkick had $1.60 back, making this free plus like a 63 cent moneymaker, which is amazing. And Shopkick ran through on this in like a few minutes. So I actually just bought this on to end receipt and it ran through instantly. So, or not instantly, but in, the, in a few minutes. So really, really nice. Um, and that worked perfect. Awesome. Because it just has any Gillette antiperspirant. So that one worked just fine. All right. The Carnation Breakfast Essentials Shakes. A big thank you to Savine's Phenomenal Savings here on YouTube. She talked about this in her video. And this is an amazing deal on these Carnation Breakfast Essentials. These are $5.88. And there is a E gift card rebate for Walmart to get $5 back. A lot of people could not figure out um, how this one worked. And I take full credit for that because I, or full responsibility rather, because I put the wrong link in the description box. So I steered you guys wrong when it's updated now. And the right link will be in this video because I mentioned this yesterday and put the wrong link, but it's corrected now. So basically what you do, here's what I did. It told me to text a number. Um, and I'll tell you guys what that number is. It is 811811. Just 811811. It said to text that number and text breakfast. Then it sent me a thing saying to reply with a picture of my receipt. So I reply with that and it accepted my receipt and said I'd hear back within four days. And it just asked me to link my email and my name to it. So I did that. Really an easy, easy process. Um, so yeah, after I get that $5 e-gift card, it's going to be 88 cents. So some of you guys said there's a coupon for this. I didn't use a coupon because in the past, these Walmart e-gift card rebates have like said the price has to be after coupon. So I just wanted to play it safe and I just purchased it without a coupon because I'm still 88 cents. I'm thrilled with that because this is something that my family will definitely use. So phenomenal, phenomenal price. 
Okay, these CoverGirl face powders here were on clearance for $2 at my Walmart. Yeah, two bucks. And there's a $3 off coupon of any CoverGirl face product. So it made these free plus $1 overage in the transaction. So that was a $2 moneymaker for the two. That is insanity. Insanity. All right. The degree deal. This is still a problem. And stupid me picked up the same problematic deodorant as I did last time. So I don't know if this works differently if you get a different scent of deodorant. But here's what the deal is. So you buy one women's degree at $4.97. And you're going to buy one guy's degree for $4.97. We're going to utilize a $2 off coupon for women's degree and a $2 coupon for men's degree. We have a rebate on Ibotta for $1.25 back on the women's degree and $1.25 back on the men's degree. Okay. Ibotta, for some reason, is not picking up ever. I've done this twice now. It's never picking up the rebate for this men's. Like, when you go through, you scan your code on the bottom of the Walmart receipt, it brings up all the offers, and it brings up the men's degree like it's going to work. But then it doesn't end up giving you the money back after you submit it. So um, I guess they don't want dudes to save money on their deodorant. So I had to put a ticket into them and get this fixed because they will fix it. It's just a system glitch and an error, but they'll take care of that. So I'll give a $1.25 back eventually. Um, it usually takes two days after I submit a ticket, and they've been very wonderful. I've had to do it more and more lately, though, which is a pain, but... They always fix it. And then Shopkick has $3.60 back if I bought one women's and one men's, making this free plus a 16 cent money maker. So phenomenal, phenomenal deal. All right, this is the Shea Moisture deal again. I'm loving, loving this deal. So for this one, you need to grab one of the, either the cocoa and almond butter or oatmeal and vitamin E. So you got to pick one of those two, the cocoa butter or the oatmeal and vitamin E. And then you got to pick one of the lemon and mints or the um, apricot and honey. So you got to pick between those two varieties because this is a bundle on Shopkick. So they're each $7.97. Imagine that. There's a $5 on two coupon from 314's Unilever that I was able to use. I bought it had a rebate for $2 back and I bought two. So I got that back times two. And then Shopkick, if you buy one of each, you get $7.44 back, and that is with the Skin Kicks. So I actually didn't have the Skin Kicks today, um, but this is if you do the Skin Kicks, you get $7.44 back. Makes it free plus a $0.50 cent moneymaker, which is absolutely amazing, absolutely amazing for that um, Shane Wister. All right, the Tresemme Pro Collection Shampoo was $4.94. Be careful which ones you get because they have these all together, but there was a coconut one, and that did not qualify for the rebate. So um, just make sure it's the used by professionals. The Keratin Smooth ones work. Anyways, these are $4.94. I used a $1.50 paper coupon from 314's Unilever, or you could use this Peely coupon, and I'll just save my Peelys for when I run out of insert coupons, but I used the insert one today. So use that, and then Shopkick has three seventy back between the buy and scan kicks. Makes this free plus a twenty six cent money maker, which is phenomenal, phenomenal. Um, I grabbed the Fannie Mae s'mores. They were three ninety eight, I believe, and there is a two dollar I bought it, making it a dollar ninety eight. We just like these, so I have over from the cereal. Yeah, we're gonna do it. I grabbed the Snuggle dryer sheets. These are a dollar eighty four, and a couple weeks ago at Kroger, I found a dollar like a just a coupon just there. You could take a dollar off of one snuggle. So I took a bunch of those. Um, well, not a bunch, but, you know, four or five. So I used it today. Paid 84 cents. And I bought it. Had a rebate for 10 cents back on any one laundry detergent. So I guess they consider this a detergent. I don't know. I'm 10 cents back. So I made it 74 cents. All right. What else? The paper towels. This was a fail. These are 50 cents. And there was swag bucks in my points rebates for 60 cents back. Well, those are no more. Those are gone. So it could not do that. But I'm okay with 50 cents. I really am because we always need paper towels. And yeah, whenever I can work it in, I'll work it in. I grabbed one of these Celestial Seasonings Teas. These are $2.37. I used a 50 cent coupon from 3.7 Smart Source, I believe. I think it was 3.7. I had $1.06 on Shopkick. And I also have a 10 cent rebate for any kombucha um, that it said this was for. So I got that. Made it 71 cents. The American Greetings cards, 47 cents each at Walmart, had a rebate for $3 back on three, making this free plus a $1.59 moneymaker for both of them, or all three of them. So such a great deal. And I was so 
so jealous a few months ago when everyone was getting the Hallmark cards for such a moneymaker. And I was sitting here with American Greetings. I was like, oh my gosh, I'm never going to get these free cards. And today, well, not today, but last week, finally, we get a deal for us American Greetings um, cards where those are in your stores and not Hallmark. So awesome moneymaker. And then I want to tell you about a deal that didn't work out. If you saw in the thumbnail, I did get the Polydent Pro Guard starter kit, which is for like mouth guards and stuff. Well, read this, Pro Partial. That is not the same as Pro Guard. And so I get up to the register. This is what I do for not like sitting there and studying all my coupons. I get to the register, it doesn't work. And I'm like, huh, why is this not working? So I looked at the coupon and I realized, oh no, this is not the right thing. So I had to void that off. Um, which is weird because yeah, I bought a rebate since the Pro Guard attaches to the Pro Partial rebate. So I just assume they're the same, but they are not. So I mentioned this deal in my video yesterday. Just disregard that because this is not valid. So we couldn't do that deal, but that's okay. Um, I instead threw in some extra gum, which this is better anyway, just for 96 cents. Um, used up my overage. That Well, I used up what I was going to spend on the Pro um, Guard on this extra gum for 96 cents. And that's definitely, definitely found by me. So... You guys already know what we spent, but we're still going to talk money because I always like to go over the final stats with you guys. So the cost for all this awesomeness, $54.39 after coupons. That's a lot. But we got rebates back. We have back $21.55 on Ibotta, $27.70 from Shopkick. I am so happy Shopkick made a comeback. I'm so happy about that because it was really bad there in the beginning of the year. 16 cents from Fetch. I just scanned two of my receipts and I got some points and I will get back $5 from the Carnation. So that actually drops it down to negative two cents. But then I got that dollar midweek moneymaker. So I ended up making everything a dollar oh two moneymaker, which is so great. Now if I would have had the five on 15 midweek moneymaker like everyone else got, it would have been such a better deal. However, you know what? I can take all this stuff and make a dollar or two and just be just be thrilled with that. I'm thrilled with that. So happy. So yeah, that's all I got for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Let me know what bonus did you get? Did you get a five on 15 bonus or a dollar on five or what did you get? But yeah, I'm so happy. This is a great haul. So yep, that is all I got for today's video. Hope you all enjoyed and thank you so, so much for watching.